Also, <laughs> also since we since the last time we spoke, mm-hmm. it was revealed that MF Doom died. MF Doom. That which, hurt. That hurt me. It ruined my day. Yeah, yeah. I didn't want to talk. It ruined my day. I text man. you and you ain't even text me. I was like, yeah, yeah, yeah he felt the same way. I was hurt. I could because we dog. I was remember right we just ride through LA oh, and just going to God man I remember we that We just get every time we got in the car in LA that's all we listen to Fuck it man throw that doom on bro Yeah 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 like that that hurt hip um, hop lost one with doom for sure RIP doom and it was strange the way well I wouldn't say it was strange a lot of people thought it was strange but I felt like what a lot of people don't get when somebody dies and you somebody and you've been in a public eye long enough your family is kind of like what fans do when they should understand this? They minimize the grief. Mm-hmm. You minimize the grief by shadowing it with whatever they feel is important. You're not entitled to know. You don't have to know. We don't have to tell you, right? Mm-hmm. And I don't think that it's important all the time for people to... It was smart to not say nothing. I think it's incredible that, that that they were able to keep it under wraps. In I think the right people the in right today's people, society, like that's crazy. They kept it under wraps for months. The right, the right people, the people they needed to know knew. Yeah, yeah. And I think that that's that's honorable. Yeah, super and super honorable. 